and this has been proved. Every project that is assessed and defected show how the cost is inflated. There is so much of planning in the project. The department, the Ministry of Highways is flourishing out of what? They are not only getting the space out of the space and the land and the houses for crops, they are getting the big monetary benefit. One lakh thirty thousand crores of toll will be collected from the people of Kerala in the estimate. Is that really necessary? That is not going to fill the state exchequer. That will not bring back the services of education and health to the people. It is going to go away to the builder, the contractor. And that is through this BOT mechanism. The building of the roads and highways is done by the construction workers. They are never getting the share. They don't even get the minimum basis at time. They don't get the due right pension and provision. But those who claim they are builders, they are earning huge profits. And this new mechanism of BOT has taken away the people's right to road wins. Think of it, we never thought that all going through the road, we will like to play, we will have to pay a toll. And if it is for the car industry, that is to go back to but the people are suffering. The people who are compelled to pay the toll are really treated as merely market consumers and nothing else. By road according to the judgment of the Himachal Pradesh High Court and few other judgments, is a basic right. Communication is also a basic right of the people on which depends the livelihood. If every road is blocked and it is privatized, every single farmer that goes through a village round and if he goes through the highway which is bullock cart also, then he has to pay the toll. This is injustice. And this has been challenged in various courts. But still the judiciary also needs to be educated, needs to be sensitized. Now the judiciary is giving some judgment on the land acquisition. But on the infrastructure, maybe the judges are still thinking that it is a must. DOT is good. Let them get educated over a period of time. Our education, our movement will assert the right to roadways. DOT in our Narada area when the new toll Naka came up. Our farmers said in certain parts, not in other parts, where were the people fight to win. They said if you charge the toll to the local vehicles, whether it is a bullet car or a small car, we will take out another road to the field. We will give our land free and everyone will be allowed to pass freely through our kids and no one will pass your way. This is also one way to agitate. So we have to say that this huge toll payment, which is not possible for the local people, and the whole BOT mechanism is such that sometimes even if you have to go one kilometer, you have to pay for 40 kilometers. And this is ridiculous. Your way is obstructed. And you, the generation old residents of the area, are compelled to pay one point more thing you know that you have to pay to cross the road. Without your consent, this cannot happen. And if you don't approve this, if you are questioning this, the movement here has had